All right, you guys, you're first gonna start with some inhales and exhales, standing nice and tall, breathing in through your nose and out through your mouth. Remember, breathing is so important throughout this whole process today. Rest and recovery, we really want that oxygen getting into your blood and into your whole system. All right, the first one, you guys, you are gonna do a plank walkout and you are gonna do three to four of them. All right, we are gonna do a plank walkout and add a push up from our knees to it. And then walk back and you are gonna do this for three to four times. You are gonna do a plank walkout. Now you are gonna bring your knee into your chest and kick your leg up as high as you can, squeezing your glutes and bring it back into your chest. You are gonna do this four times per side. Remember we are getting your blood flowing, your body warmed up, your nervous system going. Four sides at a time and then you will walk back. The next one we have is a plank walkout with a plank rotation, so knee in, leg up, and you're gonna rotate opening the chest and the hips, and you're gonna go back and you're gonna do the other side. And you are gonna walk back and you are gonna repeat this for a series of four times each side. All right, we have an alternating kneeling lunge with an overhead stretch. You are gonna stretch to the side that the knee is up on, stretching out those obliques, stretching out those hip flexors, taking your time with these and breathing. And you are gonna do a series of four to each side. Our next one is a side lunge and you are 
are going to step behind and reach over and you again are going to do this for a series of four times per side. Remember to breathe and really stretch out and hold those muscles. You will now do the other side. You are now going to go into a squatted groin stretch, sitting as low as you can, chest up, just pushing those knees apart with your elbows. Staying in the same position, you are just going to push that shoulder blade in and stretch out that shoulder cap and you are going to alternate each side. You now are going to straighten your legs and bend down. You are going to walk your feet in, you are going to cross your arms and you are going to swing back and forth. Remember to breathe and let your spine stretch out and, you and your hamstrings. You now are going to touch the floor. You're going to put your feet even wider and you're going to walk your hands over to your right foot and then over to your left foot or vice versa. Just feeling that stretch, holding it and breathing. You now are going to bring your feet in and roll up nice and slowly, one vertebrae at a time, tucking your chin to your chest. Now with two big inhales up and exhales. And one more time, getting your breathing right, focusing your mind. Pull your arm across your chest, stretching out those shoulders. Hold for as long as you need to for each arm. God of creation, there at the start, before the beginning of time. Now the other arm. With no point of reference, you spoke to the dark and fleshed out the wonder of life. And as you speak, you now we are going into a tricep stretch. You are going to take your hand like you're patting the back of your shoulder. If it doesn't reach that far, that's okay. Go as far as you can. You are going to pull your elbow and stretch out that, that tricep. 
and that shoulder blade and your side of your obliques. You are going to do this to each side and hold for as long as you can until you feel your muscle start to pull apart. Every burning star signal fire grace. And if creation sings your praises, so will I. You now are going to lock your fingers and push your hands out, rounding your back, stretching, pulling your shoulder blades apart, and lifting up and reaching back as far back as you can, and breathing and coming back forward, and back again as far as you can, and forward and breathing in and out, stretching that whole spine, those abdominal muscles, you now are going to reach to the side, still keeping your hands above your head, bending to the side, stretching out those obliques, the side of the hips. Remember to breathe. It's so important. In through your nose, out through your mouth. Think about things you're grateful for while you're doing this. Everything that your body has let you put it through, you are now rewarding it by stretching it out, taking care of it. Now you are going to do big circles up and around, swooping in front of you, up and around one way. You're going to do this four times one way and four times the other way. If you lose your balance, you can put your feet farther apart than mine are, which I will show you in the next video. Now you are going to go the other way. Nice big swoops in front, stretching out the spine, the hips, the glutes, the hamstrings, and breathing. All fours. You are going to do a big spine stretch, stretch out that spine and release and stretch out the neck and the abdominals. Do this a couple times. We are now going to open up the hips. You are going to open up, rotating your knee up and around. You are going to do this 10 times to each side and then you will switch directions and do 10 times the other way. Push your hips back when you're done and lean forward and just stretch out. You will now go in the opposite direction as you were going before, opening up those hips. On a hill you created, the light of the world, abandoned in darkness to die. And as you speak, a hundred billion fairies disappear. Well, you lost your life so I could find it here. And if you left the grave behind you, so alive. I can see. going to do a quad stretch so knee me you're going to grab one foot with both hands pressing your hips forward 
and keeping your knees close together, stretching out the front of the legs. You will do this to both legs and hold for a few seconds each. We now will stretch out those glutes or the butt cheeks. You're going to cross one leg over, keeping the other leg straight, pulling that leg towards your chest. You will do this to both sides for a few seconds each side, remembering to breathe. And switch sides or switch legs. It's okay to not be okay. This is a safe place. This is a safe place. Don't be afraid. Don't be ashamed. There's still hope here. There's still hope. going to put your legs straight out in front of you, your feet together, you are going to lean forward with your chest, hanging onto your feet or getting as close, and leaning forward, stretching out those hamstrings and that spine. You can tuck your chin to your chest, it'll stretch out the back of your neck, and holding this for a few seconds, or as long as you need to, remembering to breathe. In the same position, you will sit up now, holding your toes towards you, so this will stretch out the back of your calves and your Achilles tendon. You now are going to pull the toes in the opposite directions of each other. You're going to pull the insides of your feet, stretching out again more of the ankle joints and the calves. All right, now you're going to put one leg out to the side, sit nice and tall, bring the other foot into your groin. You're going to reach over the top of your head, holding a nice stretch. You now will repeat on the other side. You now are going to bring that one leg open, so both legs are open. You are going to lean forward and reach as far forward as you can and you are going to hold this for as long as you can.
We now are going to sit up and we are going to do some neck stretches. So you're gonna tilt your ear to one side of your shoulder and look up at the ceiling with your eyes. Roll your head down and back the other way. And you will repeat this for a series of three to four times. We now are going to stand up and go into a runner's lunge and you are going to try to press your heel as close to the ground as you can, stretching out those calves. Now the other side and hold. You now are going to lift that front, straighten that front leg, lifting your toe, bending forward. And switch sides. And we are going to end with some big inhales up and exhales. Good job, ladies.